Hi folks, we are back in Marion, North Carolina for the Bigfoot Festival. Yep, we're back in uh, for 2023. This should be a lot of fun. And uh, yeah, I see a lot of new vendors too. All right guys, so let's go. I gotta show you these cool decorations here. Check this out for your yard. The alien taking off the uh, costume there. <laughs> He's Bigfoot, so that's pretty neat. I love these cutouts. I love the Christmas one back there too of a uh, Bigfoot. Very cool. We can call him Sasquatch too. But yeah, that's a really cool vendor here with all these garden decorations of Bigfoot. You got the huge ones back there too. You can put out there in front of your house or in the backyard. And they also have t-shirts, all five bucks. Yeah, I like this, very nice. This is Madam Clutter Buckets. Check out their patches and their stickers. They're still setting up. You also have Bigfoot figures too. Very nice, so yeah, they got a great looking booth. Fantastic. And this is C&L Designs, all things custom right here. I was checking out some of their carvings here. You can hang up, check these out. Get all the Bigfoot here. You also got Beetlejuice. Look at all these alien ones here. And it's Oogie Boogie right there. They're different. Uh, I think they're also scented too. They got t-shirts. All kinds of cool stuff. Check out the hide and seek champ shirt right there. Jewelry and more t-shirts. And this is Marshall and Kathy Jardar's cool booth here with these garden cutouts. Check out that alien. It's huge. But they all got all kinds of cool stuff you can decorate uh, inside and out. Look at all the Bigfoots stacked up right there, too. I want to show you this guy over here. Check him out. Yeah, Bigfoot. And he's, he's got a, I, I'm guessing, an adult beverage. Uh, but he's walking across your grass. It's kind of cool. But, uh, yeah, they got a great booth here. And I love this alien right here. And this booth here is Broken Branch. Everything Sasquatch. Clothing, accessories, home and garden and gifts. Walk over here and check out this cryptid t shirt the kind of a Cthulhu look to it. And check out Skunk Ape bag right there. And the bag here with the Cthulhu looks like he's grabbing a Bigfoot. And check out the Bigfoot plushies right here. Got male and female. She's got a nice little pink bow in her hair. But yeah, he's got all kinds of cool t shirts over here. Check him out on the chopper there. Playing the banjo. Some really nice ones. And these also got coffee mugs over here too and bird houses. Yeah, he's already selling stuff, but yeah, he's got some really cool items. And it's just opening up too, so and people are still setting up. This will be packed really soon, as you know, if you see my past videos. But yeah, Marion's a great town. I actually haven't covered Marion as a town in itself, but it is such a nice town. I do need to come back and do that. But we're going to continue down this way. Doesn't she look awesome? She's out and about checking out the vendors. And she's going to pick up some new merchandise of herself. And this is Shenandoah Squatch right here. You got to check him out. He, he does an awesome Sasquatch. And uh, rides around skateboards and all kinds of cool stuff. And... Uh, Wear some awesome outlandish outfits with his Sasquatch. But yeah, this is his booth here. You got t shirts for $10 at these cool magnets right here. Those are awesome right there. Did you make those? Yep. Those are fantastic. I love those. Uh, Holy moly. Home to Otto. Take it from the fridge. Yeah. That'll hold. Yeah, if you get pictures, yeah, he'll hold them for you oh, yeah. on that fridge. Oh, I like that. Nice. That's so cool. That, that and yeah, I'm sure you pose for that, right? <laughs> Squatch nuts. <laughs> that is awesome. But this is a great booth. I love all your unique items and stickers and candles. Is that what is that right there? That says something. Brownies. There it could be brownies. Oh, okay. The special kind of brownies. The special kind of brownies. I, I won't ask. Oh, okay. Sweet. Now, when the first uh, Bigfoot Festival started here in Marion, I think it was like 2018, they used to have a car show here, and they've had, they haven't had it since, pretty much. 
So all the food vendors are down here at the Wells Fargo parking lot. So if you're looking for the food, it is down here. And uh, yeah, we're gonna head back this way. I mean, this is, I'm, I'm just noticing a lot of new vendors here. And yeah, they're still setting up, but this is uh, Southern style sweet teas right here. He's got all kinds of cool t-shirts and magnets and stickers and hats. So yeah, be sure to check them out. I always like going through their booth and uh, seeing all their stuff and check out these Sasquatch socks. Those look awesome. Look at the aliens up here too. And also they have a jackalope. Check him out with the antlers. And there's a Mr. and Mrs. Sasquatch right there. And I will need to pick up a Bigfoot ball cap because these look great. This is Mr. Bigfoot right here. And he's got, yeah, he's got invisible dogs too. No, these are baby Bigfoot. Oh, they're baby Bigfoots. Oh, okay. Oh, I got you. There you go. <laughs> nice. But it's not a requirement. Right. And but check out his dolls too. I haven't seen this version. This one's really nice too. I like him. Yeah, male and female. Yeah, these are great. And these are by the Petting Zoo Recycles. Those are really nice. And Mr. Bigfoot, he's got T-shirts too, and coffee mugs, and action figures. Yeah, this is his booth right here, Mr. Bigfoot. Now I could definitely get a sign like that. I'll deal with that Bigfoot for president. <laughs> That's pretty cool. You get the license plates. You get the vinyl stickers, uh, yard decorations, and check that out. You get a copy of the Patterson Bigfoot print. That's pretty neat. Forty-five dollars for him. This booth here was here last year. They do a lot of Mothman stuff, which is great. But she hand makes all these dolls. Check these out. It's all handmade by her. Hey, <laughs> we saw them last year, and uh, yeah, she's added more stuff. So be sure to check her stuff out. Yeah, these are great. And also the patches, keychains. This is for your hair, for your ponytail. Check that out. And then they got all kinds of T-shirts here. Bigfoot and Mothman. These are great. All kinds of cryptids. Just glance over her, their table there. I love these Mothman ones. These are awesome. And this booth here is filled with all kinds of, look at these signs. And you got the uh, sweatshirts and hoodies, things like that. Look at that Mothman there too. That's pretty cool. But yeah, they've got all kinds of uh, things to take home. Uh, I love these signs here. Those are nice. Look at that wanted Bigfoot right there. Last seen here. And all these wonderful t-shirts and ball caps and stickers. Yeah, really nice. Oh, I love this one here. The meditating Sasquatch right there. Bigfoot. And there he is. He's making some s'mores and cooking some marshmallows over the fire. Camping out. And that's what he does when, uh, if you guys leave your campsite, that's what he does when you leave your campsite. He'll come and he'll cook you some marshmallows. Um, check him out. Bigfoot. Don't give a damn. <laughs> and check out these stickers. Those are awesome. Hey, they have all kinds of wonderful t-shirts here and sweatshirts and all kinds of uh, different designs. Check that out. I love that one there too. Bigfoot at night. And this is Peace Avenue. Check out their t-shirts. Look great. But I wanted to show you the infant wear. Check this out. Those are awesome. Yeah, you can get your start young. You know, start your Bigfoot quest when you're an infant for sure. Yeah, deck yourself out. I love this one right here. Yeah, Peace Avenue. They look like they're all original too. Never seen a lot of these cool designs. All different colors too. And they got that cool tank top right there. I like that. Very nice. So Peace Avenue is in Shelby. So yeah, look at all, this is another booth. They got two booths side by side and their designs are fantastic. I just love your designs that you guys have made. Thank you, yep, we create all the designs. It's all original. Oh, it's beautiful. Thank you. And I want to get a shot of this beautiful pottery. This is Bigfoot pottery. It's all handmade. Check out these coffee mugs. These are beautiful. Yeah, very unique designs. If you're really big into Bigfoot, you definitely need to pick up yourself a Bigfoot coffee mug. And Bigfoot pottery also does these wonderful cutting boards. Check these out. The designs. These are nice. So they range from 20 to, let's see, it's up to 60. So, yeah, these are great. Thank you, David. Little patriotic one there, two for 35, and there's Bigfoot in the woods. Yeah, as we saw Bigfoot Knievel, you also see G-Squatch right here. And she's still setting up. 
And yeah, I love her booth. Florida man believes she squatch is his soulmate. Check that out. But she's just cutouts over here too. One of the t-shirts, kind of story here. Meet Lily, and Lily's her name. So we will have all her information too. And we won't say who she is, but we know who she is. So anyway, yeah, she looks kind of familiar. But um, but yeah, I'm guessing her name might be Lily. Can't forget the singing Sasquatch. We see him every year here at the festival. Bigfoot Troubadour. Yeah, he's the Bigfoot, Bigfoot Troubadour. Fantastic. Awesome. So, yeah, we got a card this time. It's awesome. It's always good to see familiar faces here, especially familiar Sasquatches, too, like Sasquatch Troubadour. Yeah, hopefully, I'm gonna get some more of him, too, because he jams out on that guitar. You can never have enough lawn sculptures. She got a huge sunflower print there. I think it's massive. But yeah, I love all the lawn decorations here. Got like little beavers and chipmunks, chickens, gnomes, frogs riding bikes, dogs riding bikes. And also, you got your Bigfoot stuff over there too. Yeah, look at all these wonderful designs here. I love these. Real colorful too. Stands out. Here is Barry. Right there, check him out. He's like, nine feet tall he's huge and this is marcus the creator of barry bigfoot tell us more about barry barry is a children's book that was geared towards the entire family right uh, after i made him with uh, our boys at the dinner table one night we ended up decided to go on and publish it oh, that's and so, great and then he just started rolling and we made all these other books oh that's awesome and then we had a festival coming up yeah uh, and so in a week his first making of him okay we, uh, we made him in a week and then wow and then uh, he had updates since then, so he's had a little facial remodeling where he's got his teeth in and right. his face is uh, a little more distinct. Right. But it, that took a little bit longer for the update. But okay. all in all, it's, we went big, so that way we can bring the family together with this sort of topic. I because love it's it. a fun topic. And so we started off with just the children aspect of it, but yep. then we're merging over into the basic guide to where it's nonfiction too, okay. that talks about the general idea of very Bigfoot. Well, not just very Bigfoot, but this has uh, like Mothman's in it. Oh, yeah, uh, Trooper Cobber. Yeah, okay. so it's the eight most popular cryptids. Nice. And their general synopsis from their description, where they are, and how they've had an impact in uh, American culture. That is great, Marcus. So we'll have all your information in the description. And check out the t-shirts. Very big. Very Bigfoot t-shirts. See, I just love the creativity people have with Bigfoot. Like very Bigfoot stuff like that just is incredible. I love it. And it also gets, you know, kids involved. It's like a whole family thing with Barry the Bigfoot. I think that's pretty cool. And even some of the local businesses are getting involved. This is Elevate Breakfast Company here, which is cool about Elevate too. They have their own merch. Check that out. Those are the cryptids, the aliens, and Bigfoot. These are the hats right here. Yeah, shorts and t shirts. Really cool t shirts. I love those. That's awesome. Now, this is cool right here Bigfoot Toe Jam. Yeah, I like their uh, advertising here. And you can guess what they're selling. They're selling Bigfoot Jam. Yeah, here it is right here. The Bigfoot Toe Jam. So be sure to spread that on your bread.
And this is perfect cool. Check out the Bigfoot right here. It looks awesome. Everybody's getting their picture taken with them. And this is Trisha Woodland. Or did you say Woodland? I say Woodland. So okay. It's spelled correctly. <laughs> <laughs> but I wanted to show you her wonderful pottery and check out these Bigfoot coffee mugs. Check those out with the feet. Those are awesome. And mm -hmm. the thing I like about the, this is right. that every one of the ones with the feet has yeah. a butt crack in the back. Oh, nice. Little, sometimes out. a little tattoo on the on the right. butt cheek of a heart or something. Yeah. I love it. Kind of kind of unique. Yeah. Thanks, Rich. Yeah, sure. Thank you. And this booth here is Bigfoot Life, and I love his artwork. Fantastic. Love the woodwork. Your woodwork looks fantastic, man. Thanks, sir. I appreciate it. It is awesome. I love this guy right here, rocking it out. He looks so cool. And sometimes he just, this guy over here just tells you how it is. <laughs> Check out some of the stores on Main Street, too. This is Flavors on Main. It says Flavors Fly Shop and Outfitter, also. I think it's back in the back. Let's go outside and check this out. Yeah, it looks like this was the old general store here at one time. And you got all kinds of oils here too. Um, olive oil that you can choose from. All the different flavors here too. And check the taxidermy up there too. It's an arrow pointing up, so I guess the uh, fly shop is back in the back. But this is a really cool store. Get all kinds of seasonings here. Very nice herbs. And uh, all kinds of cold gifts. Look at, the, look at the honey as well. Stickers, candy, ball caps. I know it's not Sasquatch related, but uh, well, he is. You got him. You got Bigfoot right up there, too. That's pretty neat. That is a cool store, though. So the fly shop is upstairs here, and there is a lot of fly fishing here in the Appalachians. Just want to show you this real quick. I know it's kind of off subject. But this is such a cool store. Check that out. So if you're into fly fishing, they get everything. The store also carries some really good Bigfoot merchandise here too. The coffee mugs. Check that out. And also their own brand right there of coffee mugs. Oh, check this out. Love that. Put your adult beverage in there and drink great from that. So I thought I'd get a shot of this. It's Bow Wow Petware and Gives. Check out all their Bigfoot wear here for your pet. These cool little scarves you can put on them too. They got the shirts, also all kinds of collars of Bigfoot here, and also right there get the, the front carry bag for your little one. So yeah, you got the handmade collars here, the Bigfoot ones, different colors. Well, here's a little front carrier for your pet right there. And also remember to come to these events. You don't have to believe in Bigfoot. It's just about having fun too, and just uh, taking it all in, having a good time, and. Uh, and meeting new people, making new friends, and it's an interesting subject. I love it. I'm a big fan of cryptid stuff, especially Bigfoot. I've been fascinated by the subject for years and years. But yeah, it could get you interested too. If, you, if you're not a believer, it's just a lot of fun. Uh, it'll stir the curiosity, that is for sure. And I can smell that kettle corn. Love kettle corn. Got to cook it right now. Over here. It smells so good. Yeah, it's popping like crazy. Yeah, kettle corn. Now to let you know too, on Friday night is when they have all the panels, all the speakers. So yeah, they do have a, a more serious uh, aspect to this festival too. If you're really interested in cryptids and Bigfoot, Sasquatch, things like that, definitely Friday night is the night you want to be here for all the panels and discussions. I'm here on a Saturday, but because it's more the festive time uh, to celebrate Bigfoot and uh, cryptids. So yeah. Saturday is fun day. Friday is if you want to see the panels and see the speakers and also purchase books, things like that about the subject. Friday night. So I wanted to show you some of the food vendors they have here. Got the Cuban sandwich right here and uh, Lilo's Cuban Cafe is what it's called. Fresh, authentic, traditional. So that looks yummy. Cuban sandwiches are fantastic. And this is Barbecue Bears Smokehouse. So they're out of Asheville. They got a line here too. And from what I can see, some of the photos of some of the barbecue, it looks good. Let me walk over here. I'll show you what I'm talking about. Right there. Check that brisket sandwich out and pulled pork sandwich. A beautiful view of the mountains in the distance there. Yeah, it's beautiful up here. And this is Antajitos Tex Mac right here food truck. It looks like they're local. They're out of Marion. And uh, their food smells delicious. There's your menu right there on the side of the truck. 
and this is Kettle King's Concessions right here. Yeah, funnel cakes and also lemonade, freshly squeezed. Also shaved ice with different flavors, but they also have kettle corn. And this concession here has a mixture of different desserts, like your oil cookies deep fried. They also have the uh, deep fried nutter butter, but also they have Brockworth, Philly cheese steaks, jumbo corn dogs, chili cheese fries, and chicken tender basket. And I think Connie could use some Bigfoot earrings. Look at all these right here. Great selection. And there's Evil Knievel Sasquatch. He's looking awesome. So look here. Renewal by Anderson. Yeah, if you need new windows, that Sasquatch has destroyed at your house. You come by here and you get your new windows in your house. Yeah, come see Robert here and get your windows in case, uh, you know, Sasquatch. Uh, and they do doors, too. See? Yeah. If you get them destroyed by Bigfoot, come see Robert here at Anderson Windows and Doors. And as you can see, it is packed now. Yeah, shoulder to shoulder. It's such a great festival to come to and just have a good time. Hang out with people and uh, enjoy Bigfoot. And I did want to show you they do have a section for the kids here. They can jump in the uh, blow-ups here. Have a good old time. Yeah, they got like three or four of them here. So the kids are lined up, ready to get in there and uh, get all that energy out of them too. So yeah, maybe they'll, they'll sleep well uh, when you bring them home. Well, you know that the event is also dog friendly. So bring your pup. Look at these guys right here. They're all dressed up for the Bigfoot Festival. They look great. Now I showed you the, the, the food area. We have all the food trucks. But they do have restaurants in Marion. So be sure to check them out. They have along Main Street. And there are some off the side street too. So if you don't want to eat in the little food area where the food trucks are, be sure to check those out as well. And this is pretty cool too. The knock on the tree. You need your stick to call out for Bigfoot smacking a tree. Yeah, there's your tree knocker right there. And it looks like that is from Ridge Hoppers at gmail.com. And I love these t shirts right here. Whoop. So you get the uh, calling for Bigfoot right there. Whoop shirts. And this is pretty cool right here. You get a family of Bigfoot right here. You get a baby Bigfoot. Check them out. They look awesome. And this guy here, he's all tuckered out. Yeah. He's seen all these Bigfoots running around. He's just, he just can't take it all. Oh, he's getting up. <laughs> he knows you're being talked about. You're such a cutie. Look at you. And this is called, they're called Painting Sasquatch. You got original artwork, canvas prints, posters, stickers, and magnets. I love his work. Look at this. This is great. Put these in a frame at home. I love his colors and just his interpretations. And check the dog out. Kind of looks like the dog we just saw. Bigfoot and dogs. Yeah, they get along pretty good. And look, the guy, he's scared to death inside the tent. What? So if you have your pet with you, yeah, stop here at the K9 Doggy Bakery. They have all kinds of treats here too. Yeah, yummy. Looks like they make it all by hand. It's a peanut butter Bigfoot for the pooches. Look at him. Yeah, looks delicious. Well, for the pooch. Just want to get a shot of this right here. Yeah, he's pretty cool looking. I need to get one of those for my car. <laughs> well, that sounds good. Wow. That sounds pretty awesome. But, uh, yeah. I think I'm going to call it a day. With uh, the Bigfoot hauling contest in the background. We're having a good old time. And I want to show you real quick what I got at the festival. A little bag of goodies. Every year I try to pick up an annual t-shirt 
from the uh, Western North Carolina Bigfoot Festival. This is 2023. I love the design too. This is on the back of the shirt. And this is the front of the shirt right here. Very nice. And I also picked up this Bigfoot air freshener right here. And also for the car, I picked up this Buddha style meditating Bigfoot. Thought it was pretty cool. So again, it was a blast here at the uh, Bigfoot Festival in Marion, North Carolina. 2023 and I uh, see the mountains it's in the heart of the mountains for sure so you'll love to drive up here too if you're not from this area drive I-40 not far from uh, Asheville North Carolina or Hickory North Carolina I drove up from Charlotte so it's about an hour and 40 minute drive it's not too bad at all and uh it's just very scenic too so definitely come here if you haven't been to the Bigfoot Festival I encourage you to come because you'll have a blast and uh and the love the, the hooting and hollering the uh, bigfoot hollering contest that's fantastic love seeing those people kids have a great time too so yeah kids will definitely love this and it's also like i said before it is pet friendly so bring your dog if you want to and uh there's a lot of people that push them on the carriage stuff like that so yeah good times so they have they have vendors here too that sell doggy treats things like that and i showed you that bigfoot doggy treat thing looked pretty cool all right guys you take care if you haven't subscribed please do and like as well and you guys take care. Have more stuff coming soon. Bye-bye.